Welcome to the Rico Vibes Video Podcast. Podcast, the podcast. Rico Vibes podcast. Video Podcast, featuring today's hottest artists, entertainment news, and social commentary. The Rico Vibes Video Podcast, covering entertainment worldwide. 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 And now, here's your host, Rico Vibes. Rico Vibes. Rico Vibes. Rico Vibes. Rico Vibes. It's yours truly, Rico Vice, back with another edition of the Rico Vice Video Podcast. And in this edition, I've got a very special guest. Well, actually, it's the first time I'm meeting her, but it feels like I've known her for a long time already. She's really down to earth. It's Jody Couture. Hi, Rico. How are you? <laughs> I'm fine. Good, good. You know, I, I've been doing my research about you. I've, I've seen you. I've, I've been following you for a while. But, mm -hmm. I, you know, I actually went and did my research. But I want the folks to know, how did you get started? <laughs> How did I get started? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I got started young. Mm -hmm. But you're still young. What do you mean young? I mean, you that's mean what I'm saying, but my soul is old. Okay. You know, okay. I have an old soul. I'm an okay. old soul kind of girl. Like, I was one of the, the kids that, you know, had the Jamaican parent that Ooh. didn't, you know, generational curses. Gotcha. Yeah. Gotcha. So I've been outside on my own since I was like 13, you know, like in the streets like I know it's oh, I'm for me I mm. have to protect me I mm. have to guide me you know and the only thing that ever guided me on that journey or not say guided me because my angels and my Lord guide me mm. but the only thing that helped me to get along on that journey was music really yes. so, you, so you knew this from day one you knew that's what you wanted yes to do. I knew that's what I wanted to I love I love like I love creating I love art like mm. you know I love everything about how you express yourself. I'm an expressive girl. I talk, I move my hands. Mm -hmm. It's just so much. <laughs> wow. Yeah. Wow. Were you a good student in school? Um, I was. I was good, but I was young mm -hmm. and I was on my own. So, you know, the streets were more attractive to me. Like, gotcha. I was great in school, though. I'm a bright girl, you know, I'm a bright. I'm mm -hmm. very intelligent. Very, very intelligent. Mm -hmm. But the streets, I'm very intelligent in the streets. So how did you survive? Because a lot of people don't survive, especially a female, don't right. survive in the streets. So how did you manage to survive in the streets? Bossing up. Really? I had to boss up young. Girl, shut up. What really? you gonna do? I just felt like, you know, I always had to go. Like, gotcha. it has to be something else. This can't be it. Mm -hmm. This can't be it. And that's what it, that's, you know what I understood in life lately, Vico? It's what you really make a life. Gotcha. It's not like you gotta own, it, it, you can't blame somebody for the position that you're in. True. Only you, you're responsible for yourself, and that's what we need to understand in life, and that's what I learned at a young age, and I'm responsible for myself. Now, when I, when I listen to your music and when I watch your videos, it's more on the Yankee side, and, and no offense to the, to the Americans. So, so how do you categorize Jodie Couture music? Well, honestly, let me sip this water like it's tea. Hold on, let me go. <laughs> My nail broke, but that's how life goes sometimes, being a woman. Um, how do I categorize Jodi Couture? So it's no category. Like, okay. I'm not one of them people that I got to put myself in a box. Like, I got to do that. I, I don't got to do anything. Mm -hmm. All I got to do is continue to make sure I'm good, you know? Okay. So if, if, if I'm living a life where you're going to get that side of me, I have different moods. Like, I'm a... I'm what what not, sign are you? I'm a Libra. I'm a Libra, okay. <laughs> yeah, I, be, I, got, I got personality disorder. Like, so you catch me on that... Oh, Flex ain't hot me now vibe, like, right. you know, or you catch me on a Moana de Moana general. It's like, it's how you catch me. I could be in a lusty mood. I could be in a bad bitch mood. Mm -hmm. I, I just express myself, though. So whatever mood I'm in is what you get in the music. There's no category for who you are. Wow. Who, who was some of your early influences and who are your influences now in terms of music? Um, you know, I'm early. <laughs> 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 you know, honestly, um, when I was young, I listen to a lot of like you know, old school music. Like you know, I grew up on. I grew up. My first of all, rest in peace to my uncle Steely. You know, Steely and Cleavy. Okay, that's yes, your uncle. Steely's my uncle. So you know, I grew up. I grew up musically inclined already, wow. like especially yeah. in dancehall music. So I listen to all my uncle's stuff. You know, Silver Hawk sound and all. Yeah, that. yeah, very silver. Wow. We got Bunty Killer. You know, mm. I'm a grandfather that love him to death. Like Bunty put me on my, on my first show in Jamaica. Really? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> w when did you migrate here to the U.S.? Um, it not gonna make sense. It not gonna. I don't. Really? Rico. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I came here when I was like two, two and a half. Two. Oh, very young. 
I was very young. Okay. I was very young. I was. I was very young. And but you know me, we call me a kind of artist man. So I'm just, <laughs> I'm just learn up the two. Like I just, I just, I love my culture though. You can't. I love, like mm. yeah, yeah. My art girl, my nice. I love my culture. I like the boys, everything. We get to yeah, I like that something. Then. And then I just like when I can be like this too. It's just, it's a gift. Because I, I couldn't tell that you were Jamaican <laughs> until I watched your Instagram. Um, <laughs> what was it? Your Instagram TV, and you was. I'm like, okay, she is Jamaican. Because there, there was no accent at all. I, yeah. didn't, I didn't detect an accent at all. Yeah, it, it comes in and come out. It depends right. on how you get me. Mm. When I'm upset though. What, if, if I'm in an American surrounding and I'm upset, I'm going to speak Jamaican. Okay. If I'm in a Jamaican surrounding and I'm upset, I'm going to speak American. That's the weirdest part of it all. Wow. Like, I, yeah, you get, you, you, it's weird. It's, it's, it's something that I really can't control and people really don't understand. That if there's something we can't really control, mm. but I control it. You see, it goes in, it comes out, it goes in, it comes out. So have you found any challenges at all in the business thus far? <laughs> um... I like to keep a business, like mm. I like professionalism, like all the way, gotcha. you know, just be professional with me and I'm professional with you. Mm -hmm. It's never a feelings issue for me because the only person I feel for is my family and my loved ones and the people that are homeless and the little girls that don't have mommies and daddies. Right. Right. So I don't bring my feelings to work. Gotcha. I come to work. Gotcha. Gotcha. Right? You, you do a lot of collaborations with Vibes Cartel. What's, <laughs> what's the... Um, What's the connection there? Can you tell me the connection there? The connection is that's my boss. Like, mm -hmm. when I say my boss, that's not something, not that he runs my life, mm -hmm. but that's somebody that, you know, he stayed from behind the prison wall and did for me more than a man in the streets would be willing to do for me off the bat, you know? Okay. Like, he did, like, I'm forever grateful. I'm forever, like, it's, it's a love. Like, I love him. Like, that's a man that I love forever. Okay. You know, I love him forever. I like thank you. What kind of, is it? Is it a fatherly love? What kind I'm of never love? a fatherly love, you know, baby. I, I mean, I gotta dig. I gotta know. You <laughs> no, know. you can know. I the people I, I, needs I, to know. I love him like the nice thing that he is. Okay. Zaddy. Got you. Yeah. Got you. He got the zaddy love. I, I don't care about that now. Okay. Live his life. Okay. All right. Um, what is it like going on a date with Judy Couture? <laughs> I love money. You love money. <laughs> okay. But so is it seafood? Is it Chinese? Is it Italian? You know, typical night out with Jody Kutu. Um, honestly, okay, let's not be funny. Um, a typical night out with me, like I like seafood, but I love Italian. Mm -hmm. Like I grew up, you know, when I was younger, my mom used to hustle. You know, my mom used to hustle in West Fourth West Fourth Street Park. You know, oh, and Manhattan. we yeah, right, right, right down there in the village. So we used to be around a lot of restaurants. You know, I remember one day we seen Kanye down there. That was years ago. I was a little girl, and we just, you know, my mom. Like that's one thing I can say about my mom. You know, like she always we ate quality food. So I used to go to Little Italy. Okay. Like I used to walk. So I just had a love for. So you went to City Island and all those places? No, I, I went to City Island when I was older. Okay. I enjoyed the city life, like I was a city girl. Gotcha. Yeah. yeah. Wow. New York City girl. Wow. <laughs> Talk a little bit about uh, your latest single. My latest single, oh. Proud of Me. Well, my latest single is, is me again, expressing me, you know, letting the world know how I feel right now, you know, what's going on with Jody. This is, this is how I feel. This is my moment. You know, this single, this single is like really special to me. I love this single, like, you know, proud of me. Mm -hmm. Like, I'm proud of me. Okay. I'm very, I'm very, I'm a very fashionable kind of girl. Right. So, you know, just the fact that twist the word proud and say proud. Wow. It's just, it's just like, you know, it's, 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 it's pretty, Jody Couture. Pretty, it's pretty creative. Yeah. I, I didn't even think proud of that, that, that way you until know, you. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I mean, it's, I'm proud of me. <laughs> but I'm proud of me. <laughs> How much does fashion play a part of your life? Oh my God, 100%. Really? Yeah. I love it. Like, like I love it. Mm -hmm. Like, I know, like, you know, along my career, like, that's going to be something that's going to be, like, any any fashion brand that I'm going to collab with is going to be dope. I could, because, you know, my style already, like, me being an independent artist, right. like, you know, right. sometimes, like, and it be, it's like, it's just something that it's, it's I was, like, that's, a, that's my personal gift. I'm not a stylist. I don't like styling. But if it came to that point. Right they will get like that whole creative side of Jody that I keep talking. <laughs> yeah. You know, there, there's some people that might ask, what do you do to stay fit? 
when we look at you, you know, fit. You know fit. No. Is she not fit? I'm not fit. I'm what not happened? Fit. The, the COVID. The... You know, see that look at pouch here. This not cute. Uh, <laughs> so what do you do to stay slim? Um, I'm gonna... you're not slim either. Cause she eat like crazy. She eat like crazy. Really? Yeah. Everybody know. I do. I do. Cause you know what it is. Let me tell you. You have something named man cancer. You see, when you have a man that stress you, you lose all the way to one room. But you see me you now. You look in the way you do, have a man that stresses you. No, but that's the thing now. You see, when I stress me down to the point, no one reach me, just let him go. Okay. So, so now you, that's you, why I'm But you do give chances. You do, you do give a man chances. Um, nah. No chances? For what? What are the chances to do the same shit? Wow. What are you going to do? Wow. Girl, what are you going to do? The same shit? Stop playing with me. So, so you just got one. One chance those white it. toes on the back of your neck, understand? Yes. You tough, man. <laughs> you tough. Is it the independence in your cup now? Ah, uh, yes. You know why? Because I've always given a man a chance in my life. And they just always show me why it's just like, stop giving chances. Like, if it don't work out the first time, mm. you know, let it go. It's, let's not force the issue anymore with men. Men are just, men are just an add-on for a woman's life. Cause that's you, how they, you don't think a woman needs a man in, no. in her life? Ever? No, yes, of course, okay. but when she's at her full potential, so she can attract the man she needs and not a man that's going to come waste her time. Okay. I, I agree with that, actually. Right. I I, I, that, it, it makes sense. So I want to be the best me before I mess with the man because I'm not going to mess with a man that's going to mess with my plan uh -huh. for me. I don't want you to mess with what I got going on for myself because I love me and I'm very in touch with me and I'm at a place in my life where I feel like there's a halo over my head. You know, I'm that much at peace, and I will do anything to keep my peace. So I know that any man that's coming my way is a peaceful man. May the church say amen. 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 <laughs> <laughs> so why <are> you <laughs> <laughs> So the couture, did that come from fashion? The, the, yes, it the, did. Okay. Oh, yes, yes. See, couture, right? Yeah. Um, I was 11. I couldn't afford some juicy couture sweatpants. My mom, you know, like I had a hard upcoming, you know, I couldn't afford it. And it was my initials, my name is Jody and Crawford. And then it was just like, Juicy Couture is JC, JC. Oh, at least I keep my initials. And the Couture is so fine. Like, so I had that name since I was like eight. Really? Nine years old, yeah. Did you trademark it? Is it trademark? Of course, I'm a businesswoman. Okay, just, just you, know, you say you're a businesswoman. I just wanted to make sure you're living up to the, the name. Yeah, yeah no, I, yeah, I, I, like, I like to, everything. Okay. So how often do you perform in Jamaica? Um, I was just in Jamaica in March, you know. I showed you earlier, like, March, I was in the grill, I was in St. Mary. It was a dope experience. I love when I can rock out and, hey, when we get the Jamaica, when we get the Jamaica, I'm going to get all right. That's my shit right there. You go, I get the girl, man, I get the work. They were in Jody Couture, I get Jody Couture. So can you, it's Jody Couture and it's Jody Couture. It's, so oh, it's okay. like, it's two different lingo. When y'all get Jody Couture, y'all get some bad girl. When you get in Jody Couture, you get in a bad bitch. So I'm pretty sure you probably have a lot of women who are jealous of you or who give you a hard time. I mean, that's their business. You know, that's what I'm trying to say. You got, I love myself. So I don't find the time to even worry about what you got going on, what you got going on, what you got going on. I don't got the time to worry about what nobody got going on. Because you see, I got to sit at these tables and I got to make sure these checks is correct. You get what I'm trying to say? So if it ain't about the money, it don't matter to me. So if you insecure on you, Baby, I ain't do nothing but be me. If I offend you, that's your business. So get down, cross your legs, open up your hands, clear your mind, and ask for clarity. Gotcha. Meditate, baby, it works. You know, you'll find peace in yourself. Now, you do hip hop, you do dance hall, you do reggae. Which one are you more comfortable with? All three. All three. Yeah. So if you're gonna put out an album tomorrow, you, you'll have all three genres on it. That's my biggest task with myself. I do want to put out a nice body of work, but it's just like, you know what it is though? I figured out how I'm gonna do it. Mm -hmm. I couldn't figure it out before I used to tassel with it within myself. Like, mm -hmm. what are you gonna do all that? Mm -hmm. But I figured it out. Yeah. Wherever the road takes me is what I'm gonna give. Okay. Is there anyone you want to work with that you haven't worked with in the industry yet? Yes. <laughs> Should I blush or not? <laughs> Hmm, I wonder who that is. <laughs> <laughs> who is that? Drop a name. Um, oh, a couple of names. Oh, a couple. I'm a type of bitch like that. I like a couple. Uh, I like them in pairs. No, I'm 
I'm joking. <laughs> <laughs> Um, I want to work with 21 Savage and Little Baby. Really? Yeah. Okay. That's a good combination. Mm -hmm. How about in the dance hall or the reggae room? In the reggae room. Honestly, who I want to work with in the, in the reggae room? I worked with Bob's Cartel, so it's so hard. Yeah, you've worked with the best. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so yeah. it's just like, you know, it's like I really did work with the best. Okay. And then, you know, I worked with his sons, which were the second best. Mm -hmm. UTG, they coming up, you know, doing the damn thing. Mm -hmm. Um. Who do I want to work with? Barry's um, Hammond. Um, oh, when, yes, I would Tommy actually Lee. like. I would know. You know what's crazy? I me, mean, I take it back one time with Uncle Barry's. Come here, Uncle Barry's. So that's a touchback. Ooh, say that big man don't cry. He never miss the water till the well run dry. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Yeah, I would take it back with Uncle Barry's on that because I want to say, Barry's. They don't. Barry's. The terrorists. I will just, I'll get Barry's. <laughs> yeah, I'll go crazy with Barry's. That's what I want that. Ooh, that's fire. Yeah. Speak it into existence. It, yes, Barry's, we're going to work together. There you go. There you go. So, do you have anything coming up um, after the pandemic, hopefully? Uh, I mean, I just want to get back to work. I love working. I love, I love performing. I love it. I miss it so much. I, I think missing something that you love so much, you realize what you love. Right. You know? That's why men always want to come back. Boom, on the head. Boom, and then she said, boom. boom. Wait, 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 wait. We, we kind of jumped past that. Like, why does men always want to come back? Like, we just went to a whole different level right there. No, because direction. when you miss something that you love, ah. you realize what you had. Like, you know, now I want to work harder because I know when I get on them stages, I want to go harder and harder because gotcha. I miss them so much, I'm going to eat it up. Yeah. Now, if you want to put out an album or a mixtape tomorrow, what would, be the, what would be the title of it? Okay, I'm going to give y'all the title of it. Hmm. Jody San Diego. Who remember the story of Carmen San Diego? Y'all didn't watch Carmen San Diego? No, I didn't. Yeah, when well, she traveled the road, that's why I said I don't know where my next day will go. Because gotcha. I want to travel and do it. So wherever my, if it takes me to Jamaica and I get something, if it takes me to New York and I get something, anywhere it takes me. So it will be Jody San Diego. Okay. Traveling the world, talking shit. Not okay. a thing with the clip and the thing and the thing. <laughs> <laughs> Now, you, you have a daughter, right? Eh? Yes, I do, my beautiful baby. How old is she? She's five. So if she want to get into this business, would you allow her to get into it? I mean, she, I just bought her a piano. Okay. She plays the piano. My daughter loves the piano. She's, she, she loves the piano. Like, oh. It's not something that I say, listen, you're my kid. You're already my kid. Mommy, you're going to go get it for you, period. Mm -hmm. You're going to have everything you want. You, do, you, you have everything you want. You get what I'm trying to say? So, you know, you ain't in need of nothing. So you don't got to do what you don't want to do because... I felt like sometimes I felt like I didn't want. To, I wanted to go to school, right. and I can't go back to school. Why? I had to run the streets to take care of myself. Who was gonna take care of me? Who was gonna send me to school? Gotcha. You know, gotcha. so I had to run the streets, and like I just got locked in in the streets real deep, very young. So. What did 13, you What did you want to study? Going back to school. Business. Okay. It's either business or I wanted to do criminal justice. Which I, along my life I am gonna go back to school to do criminal justice. I always wanted to be a lawyer. Really? Yes, that was my... Well, you got the gift of gab, so I think you'd be a very I, I'm good I'm a Libra. Peace and justice, baby. <laughs> yeah, I think you'd be a very Peace good... Peace and justice. You, you're a Libra as well? No, no but she... I have the gift of gab. Yeah, yeah. You do. Oh, high five. You do. <laughs> you do. Bye. Right. I can talk. I can talk, baby. Hmm. <laughs> talk about your branding, though. The, the, everything that you've got branded so far. Um. Okay, so I run a beauty, I run a beauty company. It's okay. called The Brad Shop. Okay. I sell products for like, you know, dark spots, dark clips, you know, I smoke a lot of weed, mm -hmm. I get hot. So I be burning my lips up, so one day I came oh, up with okay. this invention to get rid of it. Like now I'm getting rid of it, my lips is actually so much darker, because okay. I've been so caught up in work, I haven't really took, got time for me. Gotcha. So, yeah. yeah, but you know, and for dark spots on your skin, you know, mm -hmm. skin. I feel like, okay, boom. Ladies, we take care of our nails, we take care of our hair, we take care of our clothes, we gotta take care of our skin too. Right. Skin is very important. It, you have to keep up with it, like you keep up with everything else and don't let nobody tell you different, you know. If you're insecure about something, don't be afraid to, you know, try to correct it because that's what life is about, correcting. It's not about staying stagnant and stuck in one thing. It's about if this don't work, you move on to the next. What are you insecure about? Or are you insecure about? I, no, honestly, honestly, that word doesn't even exist. There's no such thing as insecure, but I know that a lot of people like to label it, so I'm going to speak on it in the terms of, you get what I'm trying to say? Mm -hmm. Like, insecure, what, what's, like I said, close your legs, open your hands, and find peace. And I can say, you could, every woman could find themselves. If something, that, my titties was little, 
Got him done. You see how they sit? Real nice. I like it. <laughs> this ass wasn't as fat as I wanted it. I got it fatter. These teeth wasn't as white. And I had baby teeth. I corrected it. You know, it's just like, those were mine. I don't have them because I corrected them. So it's not really a problem. It's only an issue if you make it bring you down. If there's money to correct your issue, girl, you better get up and spend that bread. Don't let nobody tell you don't do that. What I, what I, I mean, I just met her, but what I admire about her is her, her confidence. Mm -hmm. you know, you, you're real confident, and I love that about you. I mean, I lived a hell of a life, man. Really? And I'm very young. Our story, how we met, is funny. We, yes. Oh, we got to talk about that. Right. How, how did you meet? Oh. <laughs> Big up to Alicia. Big up to Alicia. <laughs> No, let me tell him this. Let me t listen, this was years ago. My yeah. PR, y'all, big up Alicia. I love her to death. Mm. I love Alicia so bad, y'all, because you see, when I didn't know my whole brand, Alicia was like, girl, what are you doing? I didn't know from a whole new world. She just DM'd me, like, girl, what are you doing with yourself? Just like what that. are you and I sure did. Yeah, just like that. What are you doing with yourself? Yeah, like, what are you doing? And I'm like, huh? Like, she like, what are you doing with your brand? Like, girl, you was playing. And long, I was like, uh-uh. How, -uh. how long ago was this? Years ago. Wow. Like three years ago. Yeah. Yeah. And and I don't even know what made me do it. I just was like, I kept looking at I don't even know how I ended up following her. I kept looking like what, what is she you saw, doing? she saw what she saw it in me. Doing with yourself. Alicia, she and did. I and yeah, I said, no, I that's you. not how you move. What are you doing with yourself? I did. And I, was that, like, I, 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 I love that, you know, like, women empowering and, women. And then that's why I can't understand insecurities. Yeah. Yeah. Cause she was a strong woman. And I was a strong woman, and she gave me some advice and asked her. I ain't never act like you. I was better than that. I gotcha. said, you better gotcha. dip. And I didn't even, and I told her it wasn't to be disrespectful. And gotcha. I didn't take it as disrespect. Like, I, I, you know, How you going to take something like that as disrespect? Yeah, someone would have done it. It's not disrespectful yeah. or none of that. But I never took I'm it like that. I'm looking at what I see in gotcha. you. What are you and somebody from the outside can see something more than you probably can. You see, that's inside. what people don't understand yeah. about me is that I'm willing to learn. Gotcha. You know, I'm willing to be corrected because I want to be the best me. That's what I'm, that's my aim. Mm -hmm. I, I care about excelling to my greatest point in life, you know? Mm -hmm. So if, if another woman older than me is giving me some advice, why should I take that as disrespect? No. Who do I think I am? Because people don't understand that I get down to earth like that. Like, Jody, who you think you are? We didn't meet in person or nothing. Yeah. Really? No. Like, I was even sending her to, you know, high, high thing profile events. Yeah. At least you had me booming in the spot. Good. Like, good. You know, when they heard, when I, when I went to that door and I said my <laughs> PR name, please believe me. Doors open. Lick a table serve to wow. on the couch is like this. Standing up on the couch. <laughs> wow. So we had a very weird homie connection. Yeah, but, but it's it my baby. Out of love. Like it wasn't to right, was I understand. Like, what are you I doing understand. with yourself? Now I love Alicia. Alicia don't understand how much I love her. I think wow. one day when she understand when I hire her this driver, mm. she gonna understand. Oh, because I'm always saying I want a driver, come on my driver. <laughs> yeah, so I'm a higher driver, gotcha. so you know that's gotcha. that's payroll. Gotcha. Would you ever write a book? Yes, I would, and I've started writing a book. Yeah. I love to write. I love art. Mm -hmm. I love everything about art. I love writing. I love reading. I love. I love reading. I'm a nerd, y'all. I love reading. Please, oh. I love reading. Like I love reading. I'm actually reading the secrets of numerology right now. Yeah, oh. I'm, I'm very big on numbers. Like, I love, I just love. I'm a weirdo, you know. But a good weirdo. Yeah, but a good weirdo. Yeah. <laughs> but I'm, I'm, I think I'm a hippie. I'm maybe. a hippie bitch. You know, maybe. maybe. And well, you, got a, you, got, you got an old soul, because the folks nowadays, they hate reading, they hate all that stuff. No, I love it. I love it. Listen. Yeah. Like, that's why, that's why, that's exactly, you see how I am, how you can just tell me, you know, that that's why I, I got myself here. So any man that's coming into this energy is a man that I pick to come in, because I know what, what I'm picking. Because I know what my energy is, 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 is showing me. My energy shows me something. I work with my energy. Gotcha. But anybody, like, I love my people. Shout out to June. Yo, June. Shout out to my manager. Yo, June. Yo, June Money. Yo, shout out to my man, June. See, I get real New York, too. Stop playing with me. <laughs> <laughs> What's next for you? And I, I can see some acting in your future. I definitely can see some in my future, yeah. too. Like, definitely. I have actually came in Jamaican Mafia. Did you? Yes, I was in Jamaican Mafia. I was a girl with her titties out that got knocked out with a gun. <laughs> oh, that was you? Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> I just watched that on Amazon. I just watched that on Amazon. I did a little oh, acting. I did a little acting. Wow. Yeah.
<laughs> they had a little bit roll. You, you see them little titties that I had right now? You see these, right? No, no, no. I got I, I, gotta, I, know I, gotta, you see I gotta go back and look now. I gotta go back and look. I know you yeah. see them little titties. Stop it, Rico. This is what I deal with right here. Oh my gosh. Can you imagine our conversations? Uh, uh, uh. I know Rico seen them little titties. And I know he knows I, I, I don't remember them, but now I'm gonna go back and look. <laughs> <laughs> Rico said, I'm gonna go back and look. Yeah, Rico. <laughs> I mean, you know, we do things to enhance ourselves and enhance ourselves for the business. So that's that's not a bad thing. I mean, and at least you didn't resume. go too big. Some no. people get ridiculous with it. No, I, li I like these. My, I li as long as I can do this, mm. and I can pop them in the nigga mouth. Oh, <laughs> 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 you planning on having more kids? Oh, yes, I do. I want a son. You want a son? But with who? Cause it ain't that bad. Come on now. Oh, listen. I would Listen, ladies, let me give y'all some advice, right? You see, if you want to have a child for the first time, Always make sure you know what you're getting yourself into as a woman, you know? Make sure you know who you have and what you carry because sometimes people want to make your life a little hell mm. when things don't work out or whatever. Like, I suffered. Like, I, like, that was my last little piece. That's private, but, you know, just kids, it's that bad for me. Like, yeah. I, I got to really know that, okay, I'm married. Actually, I want to be married when I have my next job. You know, I, I learned the value of family. You know, mm -hmm. it's just... Whole lot of grown shit, girl. Snow, <laughs> pick wisely. <sighs> what advice do you have to give to you know upcoming, especially female artists? You know because you you've made it. You know you probably want to make it some more, but I think you've made it. Oh, you so. think I made it? Oh, it. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. <laughs> no, I'm, I'm looking at her YouTube channel and I'm looking at her videos and I'm like, wow, you know, this, this is impressive, you know, so yeah. I mean, I want to make it some more, Rico. I feel like, you know, it, it's, it's, it's a level after every level, gotcha. you know, you, I want to keep excelling, like, you know, this is a new level. Mm -hmm. I'm new to your world, this is your, your channel, I'm here, we're sharing this, this, this opportunity together. Gotcha. You get what I'm trying to say? Because right. I'm a benefit, you're going to benefit. Correct. It's a benefit. It's, it's, this, that's what opportunity Mutual. is about. Right. Mutualness and right. benefit. You get what I'm trying to right. say? So that's how I look at life. So it's, this is a new level for me right here. I leveled up today. I got a new... When this come out, we, we going to be, you know, new people seeing me or oh, listening to me talk. Because right. a lot of people don't even talk like that. <laughs> or oh, I could talk like that, you know? I mean, I, I, I watched her talk, right? And, and again, I didn't know she was Jamaican. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, she was talking... A straight Yankee, you know, straight American, mm -hmm. and then she gave, went into the part one. I'm like, hold up, because mm -hmm. I didn't, you know, I, she hit me last night, so I didn't really get the chance to really research. Yeah. And remember when you I know? hit you before about it? That's when I was like, maybe you don't know that she's. You I, know, I, I didn't. Jamaican. Yeah, I didn't. And I was like, but see, I don't really, even with any kind, I don't like to label them in any gotcha. kind of box gotcha. because that's especially the one that's not in a box. Gotcha. Yes. I Makes can't. Sense. That's Look at my baby saying. over there talking about me like that. This is what I do. Yeah. So, yeah. but at the same time, I wanted to connect you with her because she's dope. Like, regardless she is. of it, you know, she she's is. versatile. She is. I was, um, I was watching her videos and her videos are dope. I mean, she goes from mm -hmm. reggae to hip hop. Like Just like that. that. Yeah. 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 How many who do you who, know who, that who does do your that? treatments? Do you come up with your own treatments for your, for your videos? Yeah, I do. Yeah? I do. I, I do everything. And everybody do their own everything, gotcha. you know. Gotcha. So we just a force together. Mm -hmm. So I can't call Alicia in the middle of the night like I need help with my video. Like you know, she already got to deal with this part of it. The I funny can't part call is she gonna do that one day because all every client do. Oh no, I know I'm gonna get there with Alicia, <laughs> but I'm waiting until I can get but, there but with the you. But the good thing be, about her, she's very hands on. The, the, that's she's what I you heard. What I just said. Yeah. That's why. That's why, I, of course, there's another level. Cause mm -hmm. now the next level is the next level mm -hmm. where she could be there. Where we're there. We're there, all scheduled to be there. Gotcha. You know. Gotcha. So this is the ground. We still in the ground mode, even though gotcha. you think I made it. I'm still grinding. What, what does your family think about you? Your mom and you know your family. Um, my mom. My mom just, you know, she's just proud of me. You know, like I'm not mad at how I live my life. I'm not mad at her. You know telling me to be on my own, which she didn't know I was going to be on my own, but you know, what would you expect? But then I'm not blaming you because I, you know, that's that's the piece. That was the biggest piece for me, like, you know, coming to peace with my mom because my mom was in the best, like, wow. But, you know, I love my mama. Gotcha. You know, I love gotcha. my mother so bad. Gotcha. I'm talking country. I love my mom. <laughs> I, I really do, and, and I'm glad that she did that for me. I'm glad she made me go face the world to understand what being a strong woman in this fucking world is. Cause I'm a strong woman in this world. Got it. And I, that's it. That's this. This. I'm country. Oh my god. Why am I still speaking country? I saw Hood Celebrity on your on your um 
on your podcast or on your on your live. Mm -hmm. Do you guys get along? I mean, she's Jamaican, you're Jamaican. Yeah, we'll be right with celebrity in our hands, man. Come on, celebrity, I'm a dog, man. Charge, man. Yeah, yeah, she's cool. She's cool. Yeah, she's cool. Would you cool. guys ever collaborate on something? No, we've never collabed. Okay. Maybe in the future. That's my girl, you know? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I love her. Like, <laughs> yeah, like, 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 she, you, you can see the, like you. <laughs> no, like, you can see the wheels like, turning. <laughs> nah, because you know her, her is sexy. I like her little physique, so I'm stuck in the thought of her little body. I'm thinking about her. Uh -oh. <laughs> okay. But, she's sexy. Yo, like, you, 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 you never know what she's going to say. Right, but that, that's what I was like. Y'all thought I was thinking about so I was, I was telling you what I was thinking about. <laughs> okay. All right. How can folks get in contact with you? You know, you, how can they follow you on social media and stuff like that? So, guys. Oh, yeah, I feel like her own in my life. <laughs> I gotta be right on camera. Is it good? Yeah, but you are all on camera anyway. So exactly. Like <laughs> I think she forgets that the cameras are rolling. Yeah. <laughs> no, I don't forget. Um, guys, so y'all know it's your girl Jody Couture. You can actually find me on Instagram, Jody Couture. Jody underscore Couture. Like, make sure you follow me. Make sure you go stream my music. I'm on Apple Music. I'm on Spotify. Make sure you follow me. Tap in. Check in. Just let you know. For the people that's gonna love me after this, the people that's gonna hate me after this, I love you. I wish y'all peace. You know, show me love. But when you see this, tag me. Let me see something. I don't know. I want to know who's seen it. You know, I want to connect with y'all like how y'all connect with me. All right. All right. How about your OnlyFans page? Ah! Jesus Christ! About that. We can't. We gotta get the, everything in there. We gotta. Wait, no, that's the We gotta get everything. So in guys, there. listen. Yeah, man. Me, I've only fans, man. But man, I tell you, want to I love to tell me I'm only fine. So you see me, I'm a vet in the OnlyFans game. I've been in it. How long? I've been in it for like a year and a half, two okay. years. Okay. I think I made, no, I got to I actually have a manager for my OnlyFans. Somebody runs my OnlyFans. I actually don't run it myself. Yes. So what's on there that not on your regular social media? No, I'm joking. I don't got no manager on my OnlyFans. <laughs> I'll be saying some dirty shit. I can't let y'all know. I be knowing what y'all be saying. Stop. But yes, I got a few boos on my OnlyFans. They love really? me. Really? Yeah. High tip is, you know. Okay. I like the big Cause, tips. Because, you know, the, the Jamaican artists are just getting into the OnlyFans. I mean, I've been into it. I've been into it. I've been into it since the porn stars was into it. Yeah. <laughs> when the porn yeah. stars just started coming into yeah. it, yeah, I was into it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And you know, I'm verified on Pornhub. Really? Yeah, I have an official Pornhub account. I am the sex symbol, so you know they do separate the sex symbol from Jody Couture, because I'm still Jody Couture. What's the, what's sex the difference symbol. between the sex symbol and Jody Couture? There's no difference. There's no difference. But to my porn lovers, there's a difference. I don't know what they see. <laughs> they might have seen a little titty, you know, so they see a difference. Okay. <laughs> they see a different shit. How do you deal with her on a daily basis? That's who she is. That's who she is. You just accept her for who. Yeah. Yeah. That's a book. You love me, Rico. Of course. Like, if you a Capricorn, course. you better love me. Of course. You know them Capricorns love me. No cat. And Capricorn and Lib was, uh, uh, you know. Very, yes. very successfully compatible. Yes. Even though I don't want me to more Capricorn, so no cat. Yeah, I'm, I'm How, I'm, girl? I'm, I'm done. My ex is a Capricorn and he did me dirty. You didn't have anything to do with it? I did. There we go. I'm about to walk out. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> On that note, Erica, let's cut out the look of I'm gonna let it flow. I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna minutes. I'm gonna let it flow. <laughs> no, Erica, Erica. I'm gonna let it flow. It, it's gonna be raw as ever. <sighs> That's right. Rico, me, 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 I told I was gonna ask you everything. Rico, me, 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 what man this is, yeah, Rico. Man, me retire to the man game. So, right? but right? you're not gonna go to females. No, I'm have a, I have a guy that I like, Rico. Of course. Okay. I got a little crush. I got a big crush. Yeah. Is he is he marriage material? Is he marriage material? I'm, 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 it's it's the reverse now. Is he is he marriage material? Yeah, he a gangster. No, <laughs> Alicia knows who he is, doesn't he? Yeah. Okay. They both know who it is. Okay. Alicia better know who it is. That's my publicist. She better because she gonna tell me if it's good for me or it's mm -hmm. bad for me, regardless of what anybody thinks. So when, when you're going to, when you're going to me, dating some, it has to. Yes, it has to go through her because she know what I'm gonna get me into. Because I'm a brand, and I gotta protect me. Gotcha. It don't matter what gotcha. I want. I sacrifice what I want for what I deserve. She, she tells me who. Does she? You know, but okay. she, you know, she knows what the her. Gotcha. Yeah. Gotcha. I. She, I mean, everybody obviously, you know, makes 
make some some faulty mistakes and of course let's of be course. clear of course um but she we talk about it and she's grown from you know the normal fuck ups let me say that mm-hmm. sorry but the normal fuck ups yeah. to now the now because she's raising her brand she has to raise the caliber of what she's doing I love her. I saw I'm being real, no, 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 right? that's, that's, that's my zen. Anybody, as you grow, you have to raise the caliber of what right. you choose to be or surround your energy right. with. Yep. Right. Period. Period. Because when you raise your frequency, you attract the higher frequency that you're raising. Exactly. Mm-hmm. You can't, you can't, attri- you can't want to or even try to attract something that's not on your level. Cool. This is not going to work anyway. Uh, period. Okay. And made may it, made it. Church say amen. amen. Would you take a man out to dinner and pay for him? Of course. So you, you're I would, I would, my, yeah, I am. But you no, know, like, let me tell you why I say I would. Because you know what it is? Like, sometimes, like, I'm so grown now that if I do date, like, I want to, even if he cheat, he do whatever, I'm going to just, I don't got time to really even be with two, like, playing around. Like, I'm a grown now. Like, you know, yeah. my daughter's five years old. So I'm, I'm going to be in a relationship, even if it's in my head. But that's not gonna stop me from focusing and doing. And at the end of the day, I know I'm gonna bring myself to that point. If a man play with me, you fumble in the bag. Period. Don't fumble the bag. It's the Rico Vibes Video Podcast. My special guest today is Miss Jody Couture. Oh man, I, it's, I, I feel her energy, and I love your energy. Yeah, and you know, like likewise, you know, it's a frequency. And like I said, today was another level for me with you. You know, to meet genuine people. You know, people that look. We already passed, I'm passing links out the door, like, okay, this, this, okay, let's, let's get this done for you. Correct. So, you know, like Wahas. Absolutely. And that's who I am. Absolutely. I'm looking forward to your future endeavors. Yes. You know, the movies, the albums, the books, the fashion line. Aww. Because All that stuff. Yes. And I, I see it I for see myself. It. I see it. I see it. You know. And with the help of you know. the super guru over there, Miss Alicia. Like, you know, no, we we doing. doing. Yeah, we doing thing. Let me not say we're trying because that, that would be an understatement. Yeah, like we doing. Downplay. Right. I'm not going to, yeah, we're, we're doing. No, we're, that. exactly. And management is real, real you know, he, he allows her to be her. Yeah. He's going to tell me that I can't beat him up. He's not playing with me like that. Oh, so that's the secret. That's the secret. No, no. He he one of them quiet types. Oh, no, he didn't knock me out. I imagine. I imagine. One hit a quitter, like. What hit? Well, I quit her. You hear me? <laughs> you get it done. We vibe with each other. Really? Everybody we, like kind of like. We got an energy. Yeah. That's what's up. Yeah. 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 We all on the same page. We know that's what the goal up. is. You know. I, I feel it. I feel I it. Have to check her. She mm-hmm. might even have to check me. And that's just been honest. Mm-hmm. Um, because there's times well, when she come to me with stuff, and I be like, Are you fucking for real right now? Really? You better not. No, Alicia. I ain't gonna lie. Alicia, hold it down. I will, I will gotcha. very Everybody much tell you very being on straightforward. Yeah. That's the only way I feel like it works. Yeah, like, 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 like no, if you shake a And nobody gets upset, nobody, nobody takes it no. personal. First of all, do you know how we you did you hear how we met? Like, how am I get upset if she tell me some shit now? Well, I really yeah. did. She ain't even know me telling me some shit. When yeah. I tell you I came wow. at her like that, I really did. But I wasn't being rude. Gotcha. I said, no, no, I know you. I know you. I know you. I know but you. sweetie, what are you doing with your brain? Yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah, so, you're getting hotter at me because gotcha. you're, you're tripping. Gotcha. And then that's why I'll forever be, I don't care what I give her. She she deserves everything in the world. And that's how we really met. Yeah. Like, as far as connecting and everything, gotcha. that's really how we really connected. Yeah, we was just talking some. Sh- Yo, we had some conversation. Oh my God, back in the days. One hundred with her. Mm-hmm. You know, like one thing about me, I, I try to stay one hundred, regardless of it. Mm-hmm. I made, like I said, I made fun, but just like anybody else. Right. But I was one hundred with her. I even told her, you know, we talk on a lot of things, mistakes, mm-hmm. and like, but we keep each other. Check. Yes. No, but it's just like if you're wrong, you're wrong. If you're right, you're right. Like, okay, we get past that. Back to the jokes. Yeah. Some people don't know how to do that. Like they gotcha. being they feelings like, oh, I'm tired. Yeah. Like this to me. Another week you or two, you don't talk and all that. that, that you waste some time. Yeah. That's, that's, even, that's, even a lot of people came to me. Not a lot. It's been a couple people that came to me like, oh, wait, you ever heard? I've even heard this uh, like when I go to New York or with other clients. This is mm. the funny part. With other clients that you know hit me like. Oh, heard you out there with her. It doesn't matter if I am or not. Not only are we're cool, that's my sister. Gotcha. Yeah, no, that's a fact. Yeah. You know what Alicia's I mean? Like, my it doesn't, I, like, I don't, yeah. it, 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 no, I that's a fact. Whatever. I don't give a fuck about none of that. Like, yeah, but then, then you know what it is? something that's a part 
of your journey. journey. It was supposed to be a part of your journey. journey. Let that shit and that's, go. And that's that's what a lot of people don't realize. Uh, you're gonna make you're gonna make mistakes. You're gonna fuck yeah, up. Yeah, but then if anything, you should love me. Right. Exactly. Look at my journey. Listen, exactly. I tell people this exactly. all the time. Regardless of whatever you think, that was supposed to be a part of my journey. Correct. That shit over with. Let's keep it pushing. Yeah, it's what I learned from that. No, I stopped that shit. I look at it like this. Like, what I learned yeah. from that. I learned L I F E W T R. I learned from it. Like, I don't, I don't mm-hmm. take losses as anything but lessons. And that's what I, I tell her. Like, we talk about a lot. Mm-hmm. And I keep her on her point. Like, stay, stay focused. This shit is not gonna be easy. It's not easy running a business on no level. No matter what industry you are in, mm-hmm. just keep it pushing. But at the yep. same time, understand, recognize where you fuck up that person, when you're right. professionally, keep it more, acknowledge that yep. shit, learn from it, and keep it right. pushing. Right. That's right. important. What, what, what has motherhood done for you? Because I know you've had some issues with your mom, so... Honestly, has, has I love my daughter so much, man. Yeah. Oh, I love my daughter. Like, I love my daughter. Like, it's, it's nothing in the world. Nothing in the world mm-hmm. like my daughter to me. Nothing. Me being away from her right now hurts me. I think about it, 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 you know, sometimes it'll play your conscience, but I know I gotta do it. Gotcha. Because I gotta, like, make sure she's good for life, life. Gotcha, gotcha. And that's that's the inspiration, that's the yeah. motivation. Yeah, that's a drive, right? That, that's, 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 that's the core, that's the base. Hey, you gonna have to set up there for your name. You gotta have it in a position. Oh, we, I, I gotta find a marker, but yeah, you're gonna have to yeah, sign the, 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 the wall. Oh, you gotta see this fast ass this, this is the third, this is the third one, too. I'm like, you gotta stand up on that chair, put your name on that. Yeah. Like, we got like Sizzler, we got we got just about it. Richie yeah, Stevens, like we got yeah, like a big <laughs> <laughs> oh, Where the mother at? Where the mother at? I, 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 I don't know where is that because I haven't I haven't been to the studio since the. the you got a pen. <laughs> I want to bring this fat ass all the way up. Oh my gosh, she is too yeah. much. She so is too much. Here, I'm going to go to the car and get it. Yeah. We are like life is now. It's on the side. So it's on the side of the, um, you know, the driver's side? Yeah, right there. Mm-hmm. Folks, I'm going to end the podcast while she go and sign oh, she the Flavor Radio's Wall of Fame. This is the third Wall of Fame. And just about, you know, everybody's on the old one. I've got from Luciano to Wayne one, everybody on the old ones. And this one we just started a few, well, about a year ago. I, I do, yeah, I do. Still. I do. Mikey them. has one. I got one, so I yeah, need to connect them. Yeah, you need to connect them. Yeah. Like the trail of all yeah. of your, your successful interviews. Because, I mean, I've, 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 it's like a who's who. It's been, it's been 11 years it's, it's of, of doing this. So. Like, yeah, you're right. That would be you're right. something dope you're right. to connect them. You're and right. And maybe do like a collage of pictures of them and just You're just right about that. Oh, From Taurus Riley to, to Romaine to everybody has been in here. See? So, yeah, I, I need to. I need to. Anyway, it's the Rico Vice Video Podcast. My special guest, Joey Couture. We'll be right back.